Shalom family. How is everyone doing? I hope everyone is feeling good. Mental health is good. Physical health is good. I hope everybody's like doing really good. Um, I wanted to do a quick uh message because um I'm noticing a lot of brothers and sisters that claim to be uh righteous are very judgmental and it's not it's not of the most high it, we're supposed to judge as, as um his children but righteous judgment not uh not hate you know not your your motives are supposed to be righteous not worldly and uh unrighteous for lack of better words. Um, as y'all can see, I dyed my hair the color I wanted to dye it. Uh, which is blonde, honey blonde. I've been wanting honey blonde for quite some time. And I battle back and forth with it, you know. But I'm like, I know who I am. I love myself. I know I'm a Hebrew. I know that um, my heart is right with the Most High. And... Uh, there's no scripture that says that you can't dye your hair whatever color you want to dye it. But um, I just wanted to touch on it because I haven't had any issues yet. No, I'm not even going to say yet. I haven't had any issues with anyone, but I, I've seen other sisters have uh, people mocking them and... Uh, saying things about them like oh you don't love yourself this that and the other blah 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 when in all actuality um people can do what they want to do with their bodies their hair things of that nature um so uh just make sure when you're judging you're judging righteously and that it really makes sense and it really you know goes with the word uh, and not with your own feelings um i just wanted to bring that up because i've seen some things and uh, I think that it should be spoken on, you know, because people can do what they want to do. The Most High gives us free will to do as we please. And as long as we are righteously moving, it shouldn't be a problem. It shouldn't be a problem, but it definitely shouldn't be a problem to humans because humans are uh, humans. They're not the creator of heaven and earth and they don't uh, judge or have to... Um, have to um i'm sorry y'all i'm looking at a ladybug in my car <laughs> but i'm trying to get it out but it it don't want to go out it don't want to go out but anyway uh yeah the most high is the superior judge and at the end of the day if he is not uh critically judging you then no human should be critically judging you on your appearance or anything for that nature i just wanted to touch on that because you know i haven't had any issues like i said and i love my color you know i hadn't taken it down yet um because i like how it looks on me i've been wanting it for a minute and i deserve to have what i want because i follow the most high in spirit and truth and it's nice to be able to do something for myself. So anyway, you know, I don't really care what people think. People that know me know that. I never have. Never will. You know, I what they say, YOLO, you only live once. And I'm going to live for me and the most high, more the most high than me. But, you know, you have your little guilty pleasures and your little things that you like or whatever. But I just wanted to share that because I think a lot of times people hide behind God. And they try to use his word and him to justify their foolishness. And it's unnecessary. And it's not going to get you anywhere. Judge yourself. Start with yourself. And then move forward. Um, but that's all I wanted to say. Y'all have a blessed day. Um, talk to the most high. Stay hydrated. Stay out of people's business. And pay attention to your loved ones. If they have, uh, if they have, 
consistent lapses in character or in their everyday uh, actions. Pay attention to them. Talk to them. Ask them if they need help. A lot of people are dealing with mental health issues and they're too ashamed to uh, tell their loved ones. So talk to them. You know, give them patience. I mean, yeah, give them your patience and uh, help them. You know, pray about it and ask the most high to help you uh, help them because <clears throat> it's like taboo in, in the Hebrew community to get help and go to counseling and all that. But really, like, it's so helpful that people are here to help, you know. You just got to want the help. The first, but the first thing is to realize that you need help and that you have a problem. So maybe, you know, you can help your loved one um, with that issue, you know. Anyway, um, y'all have a good one. Peace and blessings. Um, shalom.